check collection between customers of the same bank, an item that is payable by the depository bank that receives it, which in this situation is also the payer bank, is called an on us item. If the bank does not dishonor the check by the opening of the second banking day following its receipt, the check is considered paid. UCC 4215E2. For example, Oswald and Martin both have checking accounts at First State Bank. On Monday morning, Martin deposits into his own checking account a $300 check from Oswald. That same day, the bank issues Martin a provisional credit for $300. When the bank opens on Wednesday, Oswald's check is considered honored and Martin's provisional provisional credit becomes a final payment check collection between customers of different banks once a depository bank receives a check it must arrange to per to present the check either directly or through intermediary banks to the appropriate payer bank each bank in the collection chain must pass the check on before midnight on the next banking day following its receipt, UCC 4202B, a banking day is any day, any part of a day that the bank is open to carry on substantially all of its banking functions. Thus, if a bank has only its drive through facility open, a check deposited on Saturday would not trigger a bank's midnight deadline until the following Monday. When the check reaches the payer bank, that bank is liable for the face amount of the check. Unless the payer bank dishonors the check or returns it by midnight of the next banking day following receipt, UCC 4302. Uh, this is some footnotes. 20. A bank may take a reasonable long a reasonably longer time, such as when the bank's computer system is down because of a power failure. UCC 4202B 21. Most checks are clear by a computerized process and communication and computer facilities may fail because of weather, equipment malfunction, or other conditions. If such conditions arise and a bank fails to meet its midnight deadline, the bank is excused from liability. If the bank has exercised such diligence as the circumstances require, UCC 4109D, because of this deadline and because the bank needs to maintain an even workflow in the many items they handle daily, the UCC permits what is called deferred posting. According to UCC 4108, a bank may fix an afternoon hour of 2 p.m. or later as a cutoff hour for the handling of money and items and the making of entries on his books. Any checks received after that hour may be treated as being received at the opening of the next banking day. Thus, if a bank's cutoff hour is 3 p.m., a check received by the payer bank at 4 p.m. on Monday will be deferred for posting until Tuesday. In this situation, the payer bank deadline will be midnight Wednesday. How the Federal Reserve System clears checks. The Federal Reserve System is a network of 12 district banks 
which are located around the country and headed by the Federal Reserve Board of Governors. Most banks in the United States have Federal Reserve accounts. The Federal Reserve system has greatly simplified the check collection process by acting as a clearinghouse, a system, or a place where banks exchange checks and drafts drawn on each other and settle daily balances. Uh, suppose that Pamela Moy of Philadelphia writes a check to Jean Sutton of San Francisco. When Jean receives the check in the mail, she deposits it in her bank. Her bank then deposits the check in the Federal Reserve Bank of San Francisco, which transfers it to the Federal Reserve Bank of Philadelphia. That Federal Reserve Bank then sends the check to Moy's bank which deducts the amount of the check from Moy's account. Exhibit 27.6 illustrates this process. Electronic track, uh, electronic check presentment. Impact of the nation's check processing system. So... Hmm.